Can't escape from God, can't escape from me Broke the chains and I free my mind from slavery Study my chi, that's the Holy Spirit running me Why they think a mess is less? Native blood and I'm the best Click clack and I'm aiming at your chest I don't need a gun, cause my mind's a Drake code And I'm aiming at your dress code I broke the code, I'm out this hole Broke the code, I'm out this hole Bring your head hip back to back Throw your hands up If you wanna battle me, you better stand up I mean you stand up comedian trying to test your bad luck You stand up comedian trying to test your bad luck I give it up to Mother Goddess Love on Okay, so you guys can know that You know, people who have the seal of God You know, it, it Basically it says that we have it in our foreheads but in Revelations it says about the 144, the 144, and they will have a seal in their forehead. Which is the third eye. You know what I mean? The seal has been broken. The seal is right here, the third eye. You know what I mean? There's no denying that I could see, I could see y'all lost their path, lost their way, and um, you know, I see a lot of children disrespecting, you know, older people, and, and back in the day, um, our elders were our teachers, and the ones that we go to for advice, and, um, I know it just, it just, some people here to benefit themselves and benefit others. And there's other people that's not here to benefit nothing, not even themselves. And that's that's it. You either here to benefit others and yourself, or not. There's no wrong or right. There's no bad or good. There just is. It just is. They're always bringing these old, played out programs back, like the sickness. The sickness, the virus, putting fear in somebody, the fear uh, programs. I mean, the churches do it all the time. We're home, but it's been taken away from us, and this artificial layer has been built upon this natural environment, if I can call it natural, which is, we're talking about things that are just unthinkable, like this tree being like an insane size that you can sleep on the leaves, you can live on the leaves, you can build a huge villa on one leaf of the tree, like I'm talking about giant, giant fucking trees that all connect over all of the earth, I'm talking about giants walking around, I'm talking about you being probably 10 to 20 times taller, bigger, more intelligent, and more physically and psychically and spiritually able to perform all types of uh, like supernatural features and tasks i'm talking about like a world where there is unicorns and all types of shit and dragons and just huge creatures that just keep on growing and there is not much destruction going on there's not much death going on there's more growth going on than death because growth in itself it's just, it keeps on expanding and there is no limit to growth. You know, most people are like scarcity mindset and they say this world is, there's not enough space for all of us. There's not enough of resources for all of us if we keep on growing, but it doesn't matter. If we connect with our mother, if we connect with our father, our earth and our sky, and we let these forces run through us and we become deeply connected to it, you know, then then this growth is just going to keep on unfolding and it's going to be in resonance. It's going to be in 